I'm doing the weekly inventory check. I apologize for not welcoming you in time. Uh, however, what happened to your outfit, my lady? Look at the dust on your cheek, and where is the bow on your left arm? Why do you look like you just crawled out of the trenches? This is terribly bad manners. I hope that Mr. Forget-Me-Not and the high society you meet today will not think that the Sotheby's are a group of savages. Mr. Carson! You're all right! That's great! I haven't found you, and the servants are all... Is there something wrong with our manor? Did the Manus make any trouble? The Manus? I don't understand, my lady. I assure you, the manor has not been disturbed by anyone. However, after dinner, all the servants somehow got acute gastrointestinal inflammation. Your favorite gardener, Nick, is in hospital now. What? How could that happen? And you? I was waiting for Master's phone call while they were having dinner. Don't worry, my lady. I have double-checked the food. I assume that it's just because of the inappropriate preservation. Oh, if it's not those bad guys that man us, then I have nothing to worry about. That's it for now, Mr. Carson. I need to find the Coco Carrot. Coco Carrot? Yes. That remedy will save my friend's life. They are all waiting for me in the lobby. It's a close call. I see. Please, be at ease, and a decent meal will be prepared for your friends. Thank you, my greatest Mr. Carson. Where will the cocoa banana be stored? Ooh! Oh! It hurts so much! How come there are so many green balls rolling around in the corridor? Grunia! Isn't it the cactus cat? You actually sneaked out while Anna was sick. So did you come out to steal cactus juice again? I will get you drunk right now, or the manor will be messed up again. Little devils, I got ya. <laughs> I'm quite good. Huh? What's this little bottle next to the barrel? Manco... <sighs> Here is the magic Manco Zeb that can cure all! The kind alchemist Sotheby will not give up any patient! Thank you, alchemist Sotheby. Mr. Apple has applied the medicine just now, and Miss Marion found the medicine outside the garden storeroom. Ah... <sighs> There are still many arcanists who are better than me. But why do you look so serious? This is... Come here, Miss Sotheby. The Manus has taken action. There is a large-scale disease outbreak in the city center. The news is on the radio. According to the Public Health Service, by 8 p.m. today, 13,469 cases of asphyxiation deaths. 2,283 confirmed cases of inhalation pneumonia and 181,002 confirmed cases 
related to gastrointestinal inflammation were reported in 45 regions. Patients with the new disease have had such primary symptoms as swallowing difficulties, shortness of breath, and gastrointestinal inflammation. The disease is likely to spread in the areas of residence where the patients live. It has not yet been confirmed as highly infectious. PHS Commissioned Corps has intervened in food supply control and will report its findings as soon as possible. The east side of Michigan Avenue in the Loop District, the Gold Coast Block on the near north side and the River North neighborhood are the most affected areas. We have also received reports from Evanston and Oak Park. Until the source of the disease is identified, we ask that the general public refrain from eating at restaurants, cafes, bars, and any public places. If not necessary, please do not visit major public hospitals in urban areas. More than a hundred thousand people are sick. Oh my gosh. You look so angry, Mr. Neto. Are you okay? I'm fine. The casualties are staggering. How did the manis do that? These are obviously exogenous diseases. Could it be poison? The singing box said that people who are sick would all have stomach pains. Gastrointestinal inflammation, right? But even the hypertoxic ash of Paradiction Tree can't cause such a mass casualty. And this apple's symptom doesn't include gastrointestinal inflammation. I have recorded the broadcast and the timekeeper situation and will report it to the headquarters now. Whether it is the solution to the storm or the plan to rescue the timekeeper, we all need instructions at a higher level. Apologies for interrupting. Mr. Carson, is it time for dinner? Yes, ladies and gentlemen, dinner is ready. Please, follow me to the dining room. That's great, thank you. Do we have haggis with plum sauce today? I want everyone to try the delicacy my father brought back from Scotland. Of course, my lady. Your favorite Lekvar haggis will be served soon. These dishes are made with the latest seasonal ingredients from the manor. May this wonderful night wash away our distinguished guest's weariness. <gasps> Mr. Carson! What, what... What are these? These are the appetizers. Or would you like me to introduce them, my lady? The 1919 Boitretais Sweet Wine Mouli en Medoc from Chateau Chasplin. Creamy orange caramels with toffee pudding, puffer pod in herring soup, cream of watercress soup, oysters with mignonette sauce, and dill baromets. No, that's not what I mean. Are you making a joke? But this is not who you are, Mr. Carson. I don't understand. So, is that... What do you say is in the bowl in front of you, Mr. Carson? What is it? Cream of watercress soup made of wasabi, blue cheese, watercress, fresh shellfish. Gosh, Mr. Carson, can't you, can't you see it? If there is anything wrong with the cuisine, please let me know, my lady. 
don't know what's wrong with you, Mr. Carson. But these are not for dinner. Not even food at all. These, these are golden money! Thank you. 